Last Kind Words by Gishi Wiley. Very haunting tune, one of the uh, songs that was recorded in the 30s. Uh, don't know very much about Gishi Wiley. Uh, her first heard this song on uh, in the, uh, the Terry Zweigoff movie Crumb. And uh, it's one of those songs kind of like uh, Skip James Hard Time Killing for it. It kind of just gets under your skin a little bit. Um, the original tune was tuned a half step down, so that's what I've done. I've tuned my strings down a half step, so instead of this being E, it's E flat. So E flat, A flat, um, C sharp or D flat, F sharp or G flat, B e flat, E flat. So your strings are a little looser, a little uh, more flexible, and uh, a little lower sounding. Uh, so she pretty much plays the same thing throughout each verse. So we'll just look at a typical verse and um, break it down. Starting with an A minor. So I'm alternating the bass here between the fifth and the fourth string. Lifting the first finger off play the open string. And then the lick just sort of anchors this song is this next uh, flick four bar section. What's going on here is we're pretty much keeping a steady monotonic bass on the sixth string, the low E string. And then what we're doing is sliding on the second string at first, from the fourth fret up to the fifth fret. And then as you slide from the fourth up to the fifth fret, when you get to the fifth fret, you pinch the sixth and the first string. And we switch over to the third and second string. Same same thing, sliding from the third fret to the fourth fret. You slide and then pinch. The first two times. The third time, you slide up from the third to the fourth fret, hit the bass note, and then play the E string right after that. So that's the third time. Do that one more time. Then we come back to the first and second string four times, back to the B, uh, the G string, and I believe sometimes here the bass drops out for just a second as she plays this uh, down uh, descending run. chord here throughout this is E. Um, so if I play those four bars slowly, one, two, three, four. we come to a B7 chord, uh, alternating the bass again here, do a little hammer on on the four string and I'm finger picking that with my index finger. Go to E, just for two beats and then back to the B7. So that's a complete verse. Mm -hmm. 